was sick on her own birthday, and it was my birthday, and she's had a fever now for two whole days. So it's her fault. Lily, yeah, she was sick first. So we take the temperature. It's reading at 100, but because her fever skyrockets and gets so, so hot so, so fast, we're gonna give her medicine. And Lily, you hate the gross liquid medicine, right? Yeah. So thanks to my good friend, Eurice Veda, she introduced me to Advil chewables. They're amazing. Yummy. yummy. She actually says yummy. She can keep them. So they're just chewables. Minty. You taste that minty? Minty. Go ahead, Lily. And I don't have to chase her around the house. She just chews it. Bravo, Lily, she did it! Yes, it indeed. takes a while for it to kick in, so it might be cold for like a couple minutes, but then it kicks in and it's awesome. Honestly, the Advil chewables are amazing. And now we're gonna move on to this child over here who has a cough. I really Hi, don't. I I don't like to give a four-year-old cough medicine, but Highland nighttime cold and cough is great because they can sleep and it's natural and it's not gross. And it's not yeah. yucky. Come on, Camille, you do such a good job. <laughs> Show them. Show oh. LA Mom Magazine how you down hatch and then you have your mint water. Look at that. <laughs> All natural, no artificial flavors, no artificial colors. Whoops, there goes the water. <laughs> Our two favorite medicines, cough and cold Highlands and Advil chewables. I hope my two babies feel better soon. Please guys, leave your comments below. Share with our readers what kind of medicine do you know that works and that's easy to take for children. We hope you guys stay away from the flu this season and we'll see you on our next episode.